Welcome to our presentation on the Center for Digital Resilience, Tracking Threats to Digital Security. My name is Paige Gully and I use they, them pronouns. My name is Virginia Partridge and I use she, her pronouns. For this project, we partnered with the Center for Digital Resilience, also known as the CDR, an international community organization which provides cybersecurity assistance to non-government organizations and activists. The assistance they provide helps to secure the work of those fighting to support human rights all around the world. The CDR's goal for the summer was to develop a data pipeline which would take help desk tickets, that is raw text logs of conversations pertaining to cybersecurity incidents, and output documents that could be uploaded to MISP, a global threat sharing network. The output documents needed to be anonymized to protect the identities of CDR's partner organizations, and they needed to be augmented to expose relevant and interesting information for global security researchers. As a stretch goal, CDR was also interested in developing interactive visualizations to aid in research. Here is an example of a malware event in the MIS Federated dataset and its associated metadata and taxonomy labels. This is the format we were targeting for this project. The CDR team didn't have a specific engineering target at the start of the project, and we were invited to participate in the design process to figure out where our expertise would fit in. We developed this proposal, which split our data science work into two tasks, de-identification and tagging. We also helped identify several open source packages to use for data visualization and storage. Our first step working with the data was to generate corpus statistics and exploratory data analyses of the help desk tickets. For example, we needed to know how long the ticket documents were, what languages they were written in, and what named entities could be found in them. Spacey, Pandas, and the Hugging Face libraries were our primary tools to achieve this goal. We also wanted to create prototypes for categorizing, searching, and visualizing tickets, which was done using Elasticsearch and Kibana. This is a prototype of a ticket visualization dashboard, which the CDR team will eventually adapt, then share with their partners to identify trends in digital attacks and better prepare them to fight threats. We needed to augment the CDR data to train and evaluate our de-identification and classification models. So we created several label studio tasks to assist in tagging the help desk tickets. We set up annotation tasks for noting which portions of the ticket should be redacted and for marking what kinds of security incidents or threats were described in each ticket. Domain experts from the CDR team assisted in the annotation. Although we prototype categorizing help desk tickets using keyword matching, we believe machine learning models will have better performance once labeled training data is available. Each ticket can describe multiple types of incidents, so we provided a script to the CDR team to train separate binary classification models for each taxonomy label. Our approach uses scikit-learn to build logistic regression models with bag of words or bag of engrams features from the ticket text. Then cross-validation is done to select the model and feature parameters with the best F1 measure for each label. The resulting saved models will be added to CDR's ticket processing pipeline. Sensitive information in a ticket includes anything from phone numbers and emails to names and locations. The redaction model selects common structured information like phone numbers using a small library of regular expression rules. The model selects freely structured information like names or organization names using an NER model from Hugging Faces Transformers Library. We conducted some fine tuning experiments which marginally improved the NER model performance on testing data. Our final deliverable for the summer was a working prototype of our proposed system running as an Apache Airflow graph. Airflow is an open source tool for managing and monitoring complex data workflows and is already being used by the CDR team for data processing. The system automatically performs all of the steps we implemented in a secure and reproducible way. That's it. Big thanks to the Center for Digital Resilience for the work that they do, their feedback and expertise, and for being wonderful, engaged partners throughout the process. Thank you also to the Center for Data Science for making this summer program possible.